I want to, do I want to read the documentation? I'm male, so let's forget that. So the start codon is always ATG. There's only one start codon. There are multiple stop codons, so there are three, and viruses have a tendency to move between the three of them. But ATG is always the start codon. So it's defined in the 64 codon table. Now, so I had a particular that particular DNA sequence, which was from I've forgotten what the name of the organism was, but anyway, it doesn't particularly matter. But it it looks like it's going to be an interesting protein. But we searched using BLAST and the DNA, and we didn't manage to find anything more about it other than us having to assume that the name that we found in the altitudinous uh, genome is correct. So it's said it comes from the region 3,860,780 to 3,818,000. Uh, sorry, where's the end? It doesn't tell me where the end is. Anyway, they call it a methionine tRNA ligase. That's their description. But I don't trust them because I found something that's very similar to this in a different organism and it had a completely different name. So I want to check. So what I've done is I first went to Expercy and I used their translate tool. So I need to remember that for later so I can give you a link for it. Because that's a nice tool. I like that. Once it was translated, then we can work on protein. Protein's a lot easier because there's a lot less in the database. So instead of having hundreds of thousands of millions, we end up with uh, a lot less. So this is bacterial, so there's no introns to think about. That's why we're not working with eukaryotes. I hate eukaryotes because they can have massive, massive introns. Just much bigger than the entire coding sequence put together. Right. So here is the sequence, which is, for some unknown reason, it's called it sequence title 84. You can download them all. I've just got that one. I've just copied and pasted it. That's fine. It's a valid sequence. Well done. Uh, now I can do some search in Interpro and see what Interpro says it's going to do. <sighs> yes, you can send me notifications to say you've finished. So hopefully Interpro will be a tiny bit faster than um, running it through Blast, which gave so many hits and they weren't very useful either. Bioinformatics is just... in the good old days when we had slow computers and internet which allowed you to transfer one megabyte a day kind of thing and almost no databases. It was amazing what how much time it took you to do anything. So now it still takes you exactly the same amount of time, but for different reasons. So bioinformatics is invented for you eating large amounts of ice cream, Mars bars, and having lots of coffees. Because there's a lot of you set something going and then you wait for something to happen. And it can be quite a long time in the happen. I like that. That's cool. That is seriously cool. So we might as well have a break while this is doing it. So you can come back in 10 minutes and it definitely should have finished by then. Is there a way of pausing recordings in Collaborate? Now I have to stop it. Must be alright. 